what's going on everybody so wow i have a youtube channel about koi fish and uh, yes turtles and uh, athletics uh one of my top 10 videos happens to be how to fix a torque uh electrical timer so what i am going to do here in this video is show you how to wire the timer so here we go i use the timer for a pull pump uh, but the first thing you want to do here is make sure that the breaker is off for the pull pump and then i'm going to turn the, the whole breaker off for the whole circuit panel out here while i show you this so here we go all right so you're going to have this type of wire right here you're going to have it run from the circuit breaker to the timer and then another one from the timer to the pull pump so this is a double pull 20 double 20 amp uh, circuit breaker here so you're going to have the white line on the one side and the black hot power load on the other one and then their third wire is the ground wire the ground is going to go up on there note that when you're buying the breaker for the circuit panel they are not uniform so it depends on what type of circuit pan you have so what i like to do is actually take the type that I have take one out uh, as you go to the Lowe's or Home Depot or the hardware so make sure you buy the right one because all the wires are so compact inside the timer I went and drew it out here on a chalkboard for you so from the circuit panel you got a black a white and a ground line same thing coming from the pump so let's take our first step we're going to take the ground from the panel the ground from the pump and there's also a ground on the timer uh, so we're going to do is just going to have a a single wire here uh, that'll go from that ground and you want to go it into, into there so you've got three grounds coming in together and you want to wire them together and store it back here in the back of the timer now you're going to take your black load line coming from the pump and it's going to go on that brass screw right there and you're going to take the black load line from the panel and it's going to go on that knob right there next you're going to have another single wire here you're going to put it on the silver screw and it's actually going to connect three of the white wires together with a tie there so you're going to have the white wire from the panel white wire from the pump and you're going to have a white wire here for the timer switch and you're going to wire nut them together like that all right some final pointers here for you just to make sure you're compliant with code you need one of these this will go on you're going to run the wires through there tighten it up that's so the wires don't jiggle around and you're going to have one of these that goes with it that's going to tighten the wires into the back of the box so they aren't moving around you're going to want to put this plastic cover back on just like that because the wires are going to be under there to cover it and then you're also going to have these timer switches uh, that you'll screw on like that to program whenever you want the timer on and off so all right there you have it hopefully you could uh, do that by yourself now i'll go ahead and turn it back to the previous video that i recorded on how to fix this torque timer just because these timer switches here get uh put a lot of torque or load on the timer and it breaks the motor here in, in the back so i have another youtube video on how to fix this and where to order the parts at so there you go hope, hope you like the video please hit the like and subscribe button